Thanks to The Mandalorian and The Book of Boba Fett, we already knew that Bib Fortuna and Max Rebo survived the destruction of Jabba's sail barge. But how did they survive, and who else made it to safety? From a certain point of view, Return of the Jedi has some answers. Starting with Bib, he wasn't all that interested in what was going on around the Sarlacc pit. He had plans of his own to murder Jabba and take the crime lord's place. As guards fled from the hut's side to attack Luke Skywalker, he knew it was the perfect time to strike. Of course, Leia beat him to the punch, strangling Jabba with her own chain. Dumbfounded, Bib followed her to the top deck of the sail barge just in time to see Luke fire the cannons into the deck. The explosion threw him over the side and into the sand, knocking him unconscious. He was revived by a Gamorrean who was trying to give him some form of CPR. Max Rebo, Droopy McCool, and Cy Snoodles were there as well. So now let's rewind to see how Max and the others survived. First, I just think it's interesting that a recent comic from Daniel Jose Older also showed that Max was attempting to assassinate Jabba because he was tired of nearly dying during most most of his performances, but that's a different story. At the Great Pit of Carcoon, when Luke ignited his lightsaber and chaos erupted, he took a quick moment to say goodbye to his red ball organ, which he inherited from his father, and then he ran in search of an escape craft, which he found under the control of Joe Yauza, who must have hated Max because the Yuzum just flicked him off and sped away without him. His second option also involved running to the top deck and attempting to jump over the railing on the opposite side of the Sarlacc, but the very same explosion also threw him to safety. We don't know exactly how Cy Snoodles and Droopy McCool made it, but I assume their story is similar. A lot of people seem to have been thrown off the sail barge's deck in the explosion, but not everyone was thrown in the right direction. Salacious Crumb was tossed out of a window when the sail barge exploded and straight into the Sarlacc's mouth. So, as far as we know right now, Bib Fortuna, a random Gamora, Max Rebo, Cy Snoodles, Joe Yauza, and Droopy McCool all survived. I was especially relieved to learn Droopy had made it. Maybe he's still out there performing somewhere. And of course, Boba Fett made it, but he wasn't really part of the sail barge explosion. He was already in the pit. But that's it for today. If you haven't already, please like this video, subscribe to the channel, follow us on our socials, and consider checking out our Patreon page. As always, thanks for watching, and may the Force be with you.